Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I am Amalgam Ash, and this is Kill Alice, a game made by Idol Dev in Smile Game Builder and submitted to the Amalgam Ash Pit Jam. In this game, we move the mouse cursor out of the way. Hit points 30 out of 30, level 1, experience 0. She's got rabbit features, and she's very angry. It's a good thing she landed right there, instead of to the left or right. Oh. We can move around. Oh, look at the icons. Items, skills, equipment, status, save, main menu, settings, close. Let's go to the settings, and let's actually turn down the s sound effects to 25. Why did I do that? Because I've never actually changed any of the settings in any of these games before, I think. And we'll save because we can, and we'll go look at our status. Our name is Abby. Abby S. Angie Bunny. Aw. She's got boxing gloves. What's our equipment? I'm not worried about that. What's our skills? No skills. What's our items? No items. Okay. Oh, I love this already. I love this camera angle. Oops, sorry about that. Oh. Oh, we're a little close. Oh, butterfly, 3 out of 10 HP. Oh, it's a bump combat system type game. Love it. Hit points left, 2. Um, are these reusable? Oh, it's Dark Soulsy. It's Dark Soulsy. Uh, saving brings the butterflies back. I love it. I love it. Oh god, oh, I'm gonna die. <laughs> okay, I died. <laughs> Load that back up. Uh, it's SGB, so the combat's gonna be a little jank if it's... Uh, what, I died? I, I died immediately? Oh, I got five hit points. That's from the fall. I forgot. Okay, 16 out of 30. Uh, Ah, yes. Two hit points remain. Butterflies over here. Either they come back or they spawn over time. I could see it kind of being either way. But we'll have to grind a little bit, so let's kill some butterflies. Hit that. Hit that. I've lost 12 hit points this time instead of the 15 or 14, I guess. After killing two, that's 24. Yeah, I'm getting hit for six per. Just doing some nerdy math in my mind. Level three. We need to try to get to level four. So we can kill butterflies in one hit. There I am, level four. Level four. And kill butterflies in a single hit now. Okay. Oh, I love how this is presented. Love it. Level five now, and there's an egg, uh, but it's time for me to save. This is so fun. Ooh, Humpty Dumpty. Oh, he's got a lot of hit points. And they're all full now, aren't they? No, not necessarily. Not necessarily, but there's a lot of Humpties coming up. Uh, so we gotta... We gotta... We have a lot of Humpties. We got a lot of Humpties. Oh god, I'm trapped. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I got cornered by the Humpties. I got Humptied. I got egged. They just kept egging me on. Right. 14 out of 50 hit points. We gotta... Oh. He's got one hit point left. Um... And I'm still very early on in levels here. Oh god, 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 get away, get away. Don't get that close to people, Alice. Oh god, move, okay. We don't want to get that close because that's too close. We could get boxed in. I'm level six now. I have 55 hit points. Um, I only lose nine now instead of 10 when I 
fight one of these Humpties. But that's enough to get me, keep me saving. Keep me saving. Good, good, good. So, interesting. I'm like a punk goth rabbit, which I love. Oh, God. Oh, no. And, uh, killing butterflies. But there's Humpty Dumpty. Humpty Dumpty was in one of the Alice books. I gotta save right now, or I'm gonna get cornered again. Am I going the wrong way? Are there other ways to go? I don't think so. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, crap, it's a good thing I saved. Yep, see? <laughs> That's why I saved. Because I knew they were going to box me in. I'm having a good time with this, by the way, so far. I don't think there's anything I can do other than grind right here with the Egg Boys. Me and the Egg Boys. Crack it open. Crack it open. A not-so-cold one, trying to make him cold. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. He does spawn back in, so I've got to be very careful. I'm level 7 now. Why do you spawn back in over there? You fool. He takes four hits now. And um, being level 7, I'm going to go ahead and save. It's quite an accomplishment. I still lose four hit points per butterfly. So they're kind of like permanently going to do that to me seems. My defense doesn't go up any. Oh god, I gotta be careful. Uh-huh. Losing six points per Humpty. Oh, and I died because I couldn't get away from him in time. Like I said, the combat's going to be jank. It's just the nature of Smile Game Builder and the way that it works. But that's okay. I don't mind. I've played plenty of jank games that were a lot of fun regardless. So it's just my health, I think, that increases. No, my attack increases as well. So I will get to a point where, even though I lose health from the Humpty, I'm going to beat them down faster. See, I think he's, he's going to take three hits, but the... The first few hits are hitting harder. Let's go back this way for a second. There's oh, there's another area. Oh, I didn't see that. I'm dumb. Okay, what happens if we go to the other area? I fall. Oh, I fall, and there's Alice. And there's oh, God, she's horrifying. I die immediately. I got it. I understand. Oh, I'm back to being level 7 because I... Oh, jeez. That was horrible. I have 1,225 experience now. Uh, and Alice has become an extremely evil, destructive force. Uh, down below, she's showing no quarter. She's only here to spread grief and destruction now, which I'm not on board with. So we've got to do something about that. I don't know what that is exactly. i got to make it through the Humpties. I know that much. So we'll do that. We're going to continue to grind, hitting these jokers. I got them for 16 now per. No, it's 15 per. 15 per. But once I'm able to do 16 per, they'll go down in three hits instead of four. Are there criticals in this game, I wonder? Feels like I've already destroyed one of those for that amount. Let's do a save. As I slowly drain this twisted wonderland of its resources. Eggs. Eggs. It seems to be the end of this, though. There's nothing after. Is there? It's just... Egg. Nah, I only hit him for 13. Right? This is a different one. Yeah, this is a different one, but that's still a lot of experience. Uh, 13. Jeez. Ugh. 
okay, I got to get myself to a slightly safer place. And try to get to level 9. That's the goal here. These guys are worth 25 experience apiece, by the way. I'm gonna die if I'm not careful. I don't want to die. I wonder if the developer meant to turn off saves at any point. Made it to level 9. What's level 9 do for me? Can I kill things in... Oh, I'm only losing 3 hit points now. No? Wait. Yeah, 3. And I'm taking 15 damage off of these Humpties. Very good. Very good for grinding purposes. Yeah, love that. Um, how much damage am I losing from the Humpties? Eight. Eight per hit. Total of 24. Should be able to kill three Humpties without any worry whatsoever. I'm still worried. Still very worried. <laughs> Uh, basically, though, this is going to facilitate me leveling up faster. Oh, God. No! What happened? It seemed like I was getting a variable amount of hits with that one. I gotta get to level 10. I got to. I got to. Nothing else to say. I'd be very, very happy to play this way back in the game day when I first started the channel. Uh, would have been totally doable. Yeah, especially way back in the day. And I creep ever closer to level 10. Come on, let's go. Level 10, let's go. Let's see it. Let's see it. Yeah, make it easy for me. Make it easy for me. Just hang right around. Let me grind while I'm touching the heal thing. I'm level 10 now, baby. There does seem to be crits. There does seem to be crits in this game. But they're taking three hits now. What happens if I make it to level 11, though? I forgot to record how much, like, experience I get for that. It's 4,300, 4,350. So I only get 50 experience for killing a Humpty. It's actually easier to walk into a swarm of butterflies, and there's a lot less risk involved. So that's interesting. I am level 11 now. I have 82 hit points. I think I'm ready to try to figure out what happens when I walk over the eggs up there, or maybe this is just a grind spot and there's actually no point to any of this except for trying to grind right here where there are the eggs. And um, uh, I think that's actually probably it. I wonder if it's possible to kill all of the Humpties here. I mean, I'm sure it's possible. I wonder if it's possible at my level. All hail the bump battle system. Uh, I know Melon Toucan has made something for RPG developer Bakin that simulates the system quite faithfully. Uh, if you're interested in making something that's not just detect the event and be done with it, the uh, bump battle system can be used. Which I don't, I don't know necessarily if that's what the developer was going for, if they had any inspiration related to that. But there are a couple of notable games that use this system. One of which, and my favorite of which, is... Uh, the Frog for Whom the Bell Tolls, which did not come out in the United States, but there is a lovely fan translation patch for the ROM, if you are able to acquire that ever. And the game is just one of the best games on the Game Boy that there is, and it's really kind of an adventure game slash puzzle game slash RPG. Uh, more than anything, you roam the lands and you attack enemies, which Faerun is probably a, a really, really close updated version, to be honest, if you've played Faerun for the, for the 3DS. Yeah, I think this is just a grind spot. I don't think there's actually anything I can do here except grind. I'm not complaining, but I'm going to go ahead and get to level 12, and then we're going to try to kill Alice. I made it to level 12. We are going to kill Alice. Maybe. Probably not, actually, to be honest with you. Alice is probably going to kill us with a vengeance. First, gotta get this egg boy out of my way. I think these these enemies, these events, are, like, stuck. Uh, yeah, they're stuck from where they ended up, like, traveling. So when they respawn, they come back in the same place. Uh, kind of close by where you killed them, as opposed to where they originated. All right, let's do this. Kill the hands first. 
I don't know if that's actually like any sort of... Yeah, boy! I'm so sorry, Alice. I had to. I had to destroy you. I had to take you out. What was the story? What happened? I did it at level 14. <laughs> we're happy, yet we're sad. Oh no, to be continued. September 2024. Thanks for playing and thank you to Amalgamash for hosting the Pit Jam, to the developer of Eternal Sinny and for inspiring this game and to everyone who ever believed in me. I believe in you, Idol Dev. Eternal Sinny, uh huh? You've given me something to look up. That's awesome. Thank you for your contribution to this humble jam. It's time to rate this game. Let's go. You haven't voted on this madness yet. Uh, yes. Let's see here. Uh, fun. I'm going to give that a four. It would have been more fun if I had a little bit more exploring. A third type of enemy to grind on. But these are minor, 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 minor things. Hole. There was a presence of a hole. We did go into the hole. We played the majority of the game in the hole. I felt like I was in a whole world. We'll go ahead and give that a four. Creativity. I love Alice. I am a bit biased, so we're going to give that a four as well. Uh, I, I want to knock it down, but it's closer to a four than a three because the whole premise is like we are this character who is angry looking. They are evil. They had to go jump into the hole to kill Alice, and kill Alice is what they did. It was the point of the game. It's the name of the game. That's amazing. All right, and then we'll move on to the next game, which is going to be Doug the Digger, and we'll do so here in just a couple of days right here on Amalgamash. Thank you all so much for watching. Have a great rest of your day, and bye for now.